Let's do a quick audio check. Alright, you're all good. Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Next Step Mod Extinction. Uh, this will be, I believe, episode 8 now. Um, trying to remember the last one. Uh... Oh, we got the new companion, didn't we? We've got Atlas. Because um, we found that lab. Uh, Atlas was in it, we had to fend off uh, Xander's. Um, turns out the uh, uh, Dina was her name, the one with the green hair. Turns out she was actually a tyrant. So I don't know if we got an element from her or not. Um, but basically, we're making progress towards that. Um, so yeah, uh, I'm trying to remember what I came in here. Oh, I came in here to turn the quest in, didn't I, for the key? Because I found something. Um, so yeah, so we'll, we'll carry on with the main mission stuff, uh, also leveling up some of my newer next time on, uh, I do need to heal them, it's so Cruff and Yom Nom I want to level up, I'm keeping, uh, is it Lumire and Raxima, they're, they're staying in my thing because they are the top level ones and also they do a lot of damage which is always good um, so yeah first things first we will heal the Nexomon There we go. Um, so yeah. Um, do I have cause for you? Not particularly. Okay. Um, so yeah, essentially once I get more of those other cores that I can make, um, the ones I've been using for the others, everyone's going to have them. So. Um, right, what's the main quest I'm doing right now? Um... Oh, we gotta go north, haven't we? Yeah. Well, so we got yeah, head north. Gotta find him. It'll be somewhere in the desert. Gotta find a Naman Sea somewhere. Might show up. The only clues that we've got is that Naman Sea might show up somewhere in Palmyra. He has to bring him a Glontern and an Imburium. We might find them somewhere near Ignition. I could probably do those at some point. Let's do the story-based stuff first, and then I'll probably look at doing those afterwards. Right, keep heading north. Oh, should probably grab those. Yes, more mine shards. Mine shards and nature shards, I feel like, were the ones that were harder to get for a while. Um, but basically, any shards I can get now, because I've realised that I need every type of shard possible. For oh, I've just started a jewel, haven't I? Oh, I've got an achievement! Anger management. Break 500 boulders. Woo. It is odd because normally, like when I'm streaming, the achievement doesn't pop on the screen. It will like show up on here. Uh, ooh, jelly flux. Well, at least I know what my jelly flow. I think it was turned into. I mean, this looks good to turn into dead, but you know. Uh, right, team, Lumerae. Oh, I 
do is let the power of the array. Just can actually switch between these two. There's so much more powerful than uh, all the other ones I've got. I just keep switching between the two types. It's like, okay, fine, okay. Yeah. A lot of them are close to leveling up. They're not leveling up exactly. Right, anyone else want it? Oh. I forgot the voice again. Thank you all for coming. All, uh, all four of you, I guess. Yes, I realize that you must be frightened. This cursed tower has been a source of truly bizarre stories. Those who dare venture forth have gone absolutely mad. You'd have to be a terrible fool to participate in this mission. <sighs> wow, this guy's terrible at this. <clears throat> what Edward is trying to say is that your courage will not be forgotten. You know, in case something horrible happens to you in that place. Which, statistically, is extremely likely. Yikes. They are both terrible at this. Mysterious cult is hiding in that tower. It is their home. We believe that something in that place is upsetting the local Nexomon, and thus it is the reason for the tower's misfortune. We shall break into their headquarters and uncover the truth. Move out! Hmm. I ain't afraid of no ghost. Let's roll. This poor town has had enough. It's time for these fools to pay up. Yo, sweet boys. Rats my pal. He's got our backs. I never gave him that voice before, but now he's got it. Heal my Nexomon. He going north. Ah, oh, this is where I crash landed. Oh, I see that you recovered from the fall. <laughs> okay. Hey, Atlas, what's wrong? I'll be back later. Bye. <laughs> Call me Merida. I am the fifth child of King Omnicron. Millennia ago, I was known as the primordial tyrant of the seas. And the greatest volleyball player in the world. Yeah, no, that's a surfboard. <laughs> so you're like, Dina's sister? I know what you want from me, and I'm willing to give it to you. But my power has a price. A small favour, if you will. Okay. Oh, let me guess. Explore that cave, take care of something. This tower. Back in the day, it was our home. 
Father, my siblings ruled from within this structure. I forgot how to read for a second. And now some foolish humans have defied the entire place. I don't have time to. I, I don't have the strength to drive them out anymore. Yet I cannot rest until this place is restored. Drive them out, Ryan, then you will receive my power. Okay, fair enough. Hey, you guys done? What's wrong with you? Look, I'm not in the best of terms with those ghosts, okay? I'm sort of the reason they are ghosts in the first place. It's weird to see them helping us, though. It's not like them. You've been to this tower before? Looks a bit different, but it shouldn't be a big deal. Let's get going. So, I didn't bother looking it up, because... Why would I? Um, so, Atlas, I, th I think there's a previous game before, it's just called Nexomon. And Atlas is in there at some point, and like all these other characters are like tyrants and stuff are in there. So this is like a sequel. So I have no idea what happened in the first one. So I'm taking everything as it goes. The Tomb of Omnicron. Explore this tomb, which isn't. Uh... Oh, hello. It's these fuckers again. Oh, there you are. What took you so long, scrub? Come on, give us a hand with these guys. Alright, fine. Curses! They just keep on coming. At this rate, they'll break into the king's chamber. Fight! Oh, you're out of luck. bad for doing this much damage on them. But it has to be done. Ah! Oh, oh, get out of here! Get out of here! You weirded me out last time. What is with the pose? What is with the pose? Stop, please. Kill him. Kill him. Oh, thank God. He's gone. You're fine. And you missed, so... Does, but I burnt you now, so. Meh. Oh, come on! Thank you. Give me all that XP! Raxima level 45. Croft level 33. Yom nom level 33. Ready for some evolutions! Yeah, Croft is evolving. Got another one. The double. It's a glunch. Well, it's not the worst looking thing I've seen. Pfft, sure. Come and fight when I already did most of the work. Look, mate, if you want that guild promotion, you have to put all your weight up in this place. Now let's keep going. Edwards is ahead. Pfft. Thank you, would have been nice. Oh, green pet. Lovely. Um, right, team. I'm going to remove all your cores. I'm going to give you to Hedica. Because I believe Hedica evolves at level 36. Here you go. That's some XP. Tell you what, because it fits you, you can have the greed core.
Guess we're going right. Ooh, a Zasp! Look at you! Oh, what a shot! Uh, would you like a donut? No. It's fine. Get in the Nexo Trap. A Zasp, is fa a, a Zasp is faster and has more complex roles in the colony than a Zumble. It emits electromagnetic fields to disorient predators, preventing them from entering the hive. Interesting. Uh, Zasp, you can go where Glunch is. Guess we're going down the ladder. <laughs> Found the next trap. Oh, hello. Who are you? Halt! He means again, Ryan, my mortal enemy. You will now perish, Ryan! Are you on the Rangers? Ah, <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, that got me good. <laughs> My bones! My bones! <laughs> I hate you, Ryan! Okay, that... <laughs> uh, How did that even factor into the story? Uh, okay, that got me. Oh, hello, Zumble! Look at you! Ah, oh, I killed you! Bollocks! Oh, my eyes! <laughs> Ugh. Okay, yeah, that <laughs> oh, that that gave me a good laugh. <laughs> We've come to stop you. <laughs> Dead. Okay, I've uh right before this goes down. Um There we go. Hello. What have we learned about this quarter so far, Bonnie? They believe that only Omnicron himself can hold the title of a king, meaning that the other tyrants are unworthy. So what? Omnicron is gone? They've been trying to resurrect him, to no avail. Please, that's too cliché. Well, something is upsetting the world next time on. I don't believe it either, but I'll be kicking myself if some ancient demon awakens on my watch. Come, there's no time to waste. Alright, fine. So why are they so obsessed with Ryan's Tyrant Egg? They want to destroy any Tyrant that might oppose Omnicron, including yours, I guess. It's kind of good that they're hunting Tyrants, but bringing back Omnicron isn't that great. Okay, uh... Do you have something? You're doing well, this mission will be a great success. Okay. Take a break, kid. I'll only get worse from here run. It's good to work with you again, Ryan. I couldn't believe it when they told me that you handled Mulsimer on your own. Whoa. Yeah, it did. You got knocked the fuck out, didn't you? Uh -huh. Uh. Wow. Oh, okay. Now, yeah, now you want to survive. Oh yeah, level 34. Surviving again. A 
Dominator. About to revive. There's a chest down here, most likely with a bloody companion in it. Ooh! I might get myself that. Yes! What a shot! Uh, would you like a peach? It's pink, just like you. Damn it! Oh yeah! I know I had it, but this one's much higher level. From the depths of the ocean comes this squishy friend. Its brain power allows it to levitate for some time. those XP things back to but I'm gonna give it two sass oh nothing stand there oh I'll take you Never mind. Wait, so nothing's down here, so why is there a thing? <laughs> Hello. You got here quick. Right, right. You just went ahead to fight the court leaders. You must support them. I have enough supplies to heal your party, but only once. Come talk to me if you need. Okay. We, uh... Oh, right, okay. So, I've got to try and use it wisely. Cosmic charm. Hello, Red Ranger. Young Tamer. What is humanity's greatest sin? The downfall of Omnicron, the true king of monsters, of course. Now look at our miserable world. The natural order of the planet has been forever scarred. Tell me, Ryan, is it not right to bring back the ancient king? It is not right to atone for our sins. Can't reach me now, puny tamer. Nobody told me that you could do that. Oh yeah. Navigator, it's your turn. Good thing I have one. Boom! That means it like it would switch what I use. Okay, so it's just a way of going. Oh, you can't move because this. Well, I want one thing. Oh, what I just use. Okay. Don't care. I'm gonna 
use fire against fire. Oh, that does it. Switch stuff out. You've got one too. Lumeray, level 35 Hedica. Why are you standing there? Oh, hello. Not too shabby, Ryan. Hmm, funny thing, these courtists. You might think that I'd spoil their idea of resurrecting Omnicron. But no, what this world needs is something that my father never had. You have aged well, Atlas. I heard that you're here to help fight against the tyrants. Good luck with that. You're fine with this? I thought you hated humans. I don't care about the miserable humans. The crisis that we're facing is far bigger than such men me menial quarrels, as you will soon witness. Besides, I don't like any of the tyrants out there. The idea of them taking over my father's throne is unfunny. At least one tyrant has to win and become the king. Surely there's a good one. Yes, a worthy tyrant to take the throne does in fact exist. It lies dormant inside the egg of yours. How can you be so sure? You'll understand when the egg finally hatches. Is that why the ghosts have been helping us? They believe that Omnicron is true successor with the hatch from this egg? Right, but where did this egg come from in the first place? These questions that need answers. Hello, Jaloon. Goodbye, Jaloon. <laughs> I feel so evil. Susp is level 35. Which means evolution time. Oh yeah! Zapnik. Oh, hello. Oh, you again? <laughs> God's sake. Well, hello there, buddy. Long time no see. Yep, these quarters have been coming after me and Nipholas for a long time. Figured that I should join the fight. <laughs> oh, don't get me wrong, Ryan. I'm not your friend. Oh, you need you. You're the guild's lapdog, so you're going to hunt me down sooner or later. You can't win this time, bud. My Navalis is fully healed up now. Ah. Alright, guess I've got no choice. Oh, bad luck there. I have the grass type. Oh, you are, you are so screwed. You are so screwed! Have a poison cloud. Not sure what that does. Oh, it's so sad you only have water types. I 
I feel bad for doing this, but uh All that XP. Two levels. Oh, oh Green Bay Gremlin, thank you very much for the raid. Uh, hello, everyone. Uh, welcome to my stream of uh, Nexomon. Um, as you see, it's very similar to Pokemon. Um, I'm. Mo I don't know if I'm most of the way through the story right now. Um, I found Omnicron's lair, who's like this super big tyrant. Um, so yeah. But uh, yeah, um, hello to all of you. <laughs> I don't really normally get anyone uh, really watching this, like maybe one or two people. But uh, yeah. <laughs> Sound next level 37. Oh, another evolution. Here we go. New Siddle. Okay. Oh, hello. Oh, got an achievement. Renegade Atlanta. Defeat Atlantis in the Valley in the Frozen Tundra. Oh, she forgot. Oh god! <laughs> the volleyball match set her off. Uh oh. Uh oh. Run. Run. <laughs> Oh, nice. Um, I yeah, I, I do need to. Uh, so I do need to find the first uh, next one game. Uh, I do appreciate the love very much, uh, Green Bay Gremlin. Um, yeah, um, I've jumped straight into this one. I've never played the first one, so like Atlas, I guess, is in the first next one, which is why I have no clue about them. Um, so. Yeah, like a lot of this is a new experience to me. I think like the reason I picked this up was because uh, there's a thing on True Achievements that's saying like because Pokemon is it Legends Arceus came out recently, and they're going oh games that are similar to Pokemon, and then like this is one of them. So, but uh, I'm, I'm guessing the first one's similar to this one at least because you know. But, uh, yes, I, I I appreciate the love a lot. Um, it is very, very, very rare that I get more than five viewers. <laughs> ah, four HP. Well, let's finish off. Right. Uh, who's this? Edward. You facing the Green Ranger? Machine. Well, that sounded very backhanded, didn't it? I'll leave this one to you. You seem like you can deal with him. Oh, okay. Bad start. Uh, switch to fire. Oh, uh, I'm from the UK. I'm from England. Um, middle of England. So um, there, there are a lot of other English accents which are stronger than mine. Um, yeah, like I, I, 
what's the way to put it? Like, where I've been playing this, I've been doing like a bit of the the reading the dialogue. I've I've started to give Edward like the really uppity voice, where he's like, "Oh yes, yeah, I I'm a legendary tamer myself." I think. Like not not all all of, like a majority of them I just read in my normal voice, and then there's the occasional one where I'll try and read them a bit differently. Um, I really really enjoy the sarkiness of Coco. Uh, like the, fir the first bits of dialogue, I was like, oh, we stuck with this character, and then after a while, I was like, no, I I, I like Coco because Coco's literally like what everyone would think in the game. Whereas like you uh, early on, it's like you can walk into people's houses and they go, what are you doing? Get out! And then she just goes. Did you just walk into someone's house? Like, why? Why would you do that? And it's like, yeah, like that makes sense. Like, it, it, it's just so funny, like how in like the Pokemon games, everyone's just so casual about letting you walk around. So, uh... but I'll I'll be sure to give you a follow, uh, as a sign of appreciation. I'm, I'm terrible with my words. You'll, you'll probably soon figure out in a minute I'm terrible at reading as well. <laughs> I'll start trying to read it and then I'll jump ahead two words. Okay, who's showing up now? Oh! Wait. Oh yeah, Nadine. Oh, look at you. Doing some spring cleaning in our old home, are we? Your friend Lydia asked me to deliver you a message, Ryan. She's found Amelie's location at long last. You are to meet with your friends at the orphanage later on. Understood? Of course, always back to the orphanage. Goodness, your tyrant egg still hasn't hatched. If I were you, I wouldn't fight Velos without my tyrant. It'd be a very short and sad fight. Oh, my my. Hello there, tiny robot. Oh no. Fear me not, I lack the power to crush you, despite being the only thing I want to do right now. But who knows, maybe that resurrection machine can work on me. Mm hmm. Got Atlas as a... Okay, guys, we gotta hurry and destroy that machine. Omnicron's soul was destroyed, that's why it can't be revived. But his kids might actually find a way back. Isn't that a good thing? They've been helpful this whole time. I have no idea why they are being so nice to you. But that's definitely not like them. Come on. Something's really fishy. Did you hear? Lydia found Emily's location. We should visit the orphanage after we're done with this place. She's right. Without a tyrant, we stand no chance against Vados. So it's like, I, I know like Coco does like occasional objective reminders. So it's like... Oh, you've done this. We should probably go here now. Uh. Hello, Puggard. Puggard? Puggard? Puggard. He's absolutely Puggard when he fights me. What a shot. Uh, I'm going to feed you your dog. So, what would a dog eat? Would you like one of these? Ah, oh, I'm terrible with this whole food thing. It's fine. But, it means I can try and capture you now. I do like this minigame. It's pretty cool. Yeah! This trusty Nexomon is known to take too many risks during battle, making it a little unreliable. You can go to storage. Ah, uh, you've healed me, haven't you? you must assist the other guild members. They're fine. Yeah, okay. One more. Let's go down this corridor. What are we going to find? Oh, hang on, before I actually go in there. Ah. Uh... I'll give a uh, ether to Lumiere. I keep wanting to call it Lumiere, <laughs> like uh, the lantern from New Beast. Can't believe I almost forgot that. I was like, what? Yeah! Hmm. Do you like a green pear? Because you're green? God. <laughs> it's fine. Ah, uh, right, let's capture you. Why why X Y B B Y Y? Bye. All right. Let's 
good thing I have plenty of Nexo traps. We go again. Hey, why the next Yeah. Bum real. This Nexo mod uses its fluffy chest for defense while landing attacks with its heavy feet. Its twin leaf wings distract its opponent while the bloom on its back allows for greater attacks. Okay. Uh, you can go to storage as well. I already have a super powerful leaf type, thank you very much. Oh no, they're all dead! Hello. The purple ranger. The too late tamer of the guild. Your comrades were pathetic. I'll show you. Ha, what are you trying to do, kid? You can't just rush towards the boss. This is a well-established design. Oh yeah. <laughs> what? Did your tyrant egg do that? How could this be? An egg? What's the deal with an egg? Bite me. Okay, that looks pretty cool. I want that one now. Uh, okay, I don't know how I feel about it. Okay, so for you lot, I forgot what it's called, but there's one that really creeps me out. It's the it's a weird cow thing. It basically says it's like a wrestler or something, but it just the just the pose it has is really weird. I forgot what it's like. When, once I finish this battle, I'm gonna try and find it because it, 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 yeah, it it freaked me out when I saw it in, like in my last one. I did. We got two left. Come on, I can survive one more hit. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. I should probably heal you. Or, I'll just swap you out. And then I'll heal afterwards. Oh, I'm paralyzed. Well, that's fine, because uh, I accidentally did that move. That's more like it. Yes! Not much XP there. Two more leveled up, which is good. Oh, now you're fine. <laughs> Whoa. Ryan, did you actually beat those guys? What did I tell you? Ryan knows his stuff. Can't go wrong with him in your team. Jeez, get a room. Let's move. Headman must be waiting for us. Um. Right, first things first. Uh, do I have an anti-poison? Yes. Right there. Um, I'll give you that. Give you that. Give you that. Uh, Anti-paralyze. There we go. Oh yeah, um, before I forget, where is it? It's a normal type. I'm sure it's a normal type. That! Bulligan! What is that? That is so weird. I don't like it. <laughs> like, it's just the pose and just like, yeah. It's like a powerful wrestler with a wide variety of moves. It likes to grab, toss, submit, and smash its opponents while showing off. Ugh, just nightmare fuel that one is. Found the little version. Hello. Ah, oh, yes, thank God I didn't kill you. Sorry, sorry about that. The high pitched squeal there. A lot of these are adorable, so uh, yeah, I like them a lot. Um, oh, I probably should check the dog thing to see what it like. Do you want a donut? <sighs> That's fine. I'm gonna try capturing you now. Yeah! Poil! An adorable Nexmon dressed as a sailor, always ready for action and extremely loyal. Oh, he's a super cute Nexomon! <laughs> I 
I know. What was the first one? There's one that I saw straight away. I'm trying to remember what it was. Like one of the very first ones I saw and I was like, Oh my god, look at you! Um... So, no, that's a profile. It would have been... We'll be going through a lot of these. Like, Gri Griff is kind of cute. Um, Force Fant was definitely adorable. It was one of the very early ones. I will find it. That ball brick is absolutely adorable. Um, oh, that's that uh, Ruby. That like, Ruby was the first one. I was like, oh, it's very weird that it's got a bit of its ear off. But then it evolves into that thing. And I'm like, what happened? Look, it goes from that to that. <laughs> Uh, that's adorable. They just give a lot of them like the like the big like eyes. I don't know which one I like the most though. Oh, Jaloon's pretty cute. That's very cute. Oh yeah, that was one. Fanling as well. That was one of the early ones. Blitz. Blitz alright. I don't remember coming across that one, but that is very adorable. Rust is adorable. Leechy's adorable in a way. That reminds me of a small... Like, do you remember Avatar before they changed it? The... The last airbender whatever you, you know what I mean um, like the animated thing that reminds me of the giant creature that he flies on but obviously this one's a lot smaller um, Cruff reminds me a lot of Totodile from Pokemon Silver and Gold I believe it is Crew's pretty cute Woozy's very cute. It's gone cute. I mean, it's in the name, so. I don't know if that rules it out. I'm just going through all these, going, oh, which of these is adorable? Mimi's pretty cute. Pongo. Hydrip is very adorable. Sure, there's another one that I've seen before. Tantrant looks cute. I mean, he's angry, but still adorable. Beardly's adorable. That's very adorable. And I think I'm just getting to the bigger stuff now. I need to find one of them at some point as well. All right, let's get on with the uh, the story. Yeah, it, it's one or the other. Sometimes both. <laughs> Excellent job, all of you. You have already proven to be some of the finest tamers in our guild. With the members of this court defeated, their experiments have come to a halt. The town ought to be saved now. Hold on. Boss of these cultists is somewhere new. It's... Told you, can't read. The boss, of this... <laughs> the boss of these cultists is nowhere to be found. Yes, something isn't right. Where's the leader? Did he just run away? Why is it... I feel like a little bit it's going to be like Edward's the leader. No matter. I found their machinery in the chamber behind me. Destruction of said device is our priority. Let's move. Never mind. That didn't seem odd in the slightest. Right, carry on. Oh, hello. Oh, there's some spare supplies that we wanted me to give you. Here, why don't you take these? Two ultra elixirs? Oh yeah! Right, once we return to the capital, pay a visit to the medical building next to my lab. You really need to get that sp- Oh, right, yeah, yeah. Because um, <laughs> obviously every time you do something, she goes, yeah, like that. Because um, I remember you get your bronze badge, it like runs down the corridor and goes, yeah. And everyone's like, why did you do that? Oh, yeah, please do that. I need some closure. I like how with everything, it does a little peace sign. It is broken. 
Undoubtedly, this is what's been upsetting the local Nexomon. I wonder if the original blueprints are nearby. Should any of you find the blueprints, they are to be destroyed. Ancient monsters are the last thing that... Uh, controls are low. Hang on. Get out of the way. I need to read what that says. Ancient monsters are the last thing we need right now. But sir, the blueprints are invaluable. The greatest minds of a generation. The greatest psychopaths of a generation, Bonnie. Everything that is wrong in our world seems... Stems from the crud and his accursed offspring. Uh oh, someone's not happy. This quake was the doing of resurrected monster, I swear. Oh, hello. A dragon? What is that thing doing here? Dang, there's got to be a tough one. Did this day get any worse? Yeah, you're going to get knocked with how high. Another one? Oh, you had to open your mouth, didn't you? I hate my job. Ugh, could this say get any what? Please shut up, man. Yeah, <laughs> pretty much the same thing. Thank you very much, Petrie1379. Um, thank you for tuning in for a bit. Um, hope you enjoy your food. Hey, you told me that dragons only attack tyrants. It's true, but something has gone into them lately. Focus, we'll figure that out later. Where's Xander's where we need to punch a dragon? Oh, how did this trick? The rest of you team up against the other one. Hi yeah. Battle formations. Oh, you're a thunder type. I'm so sorry. I'm effective against you. Oh, but you do a lot of damage. I can see why I was given the... Uh, EMP on me. I'm just gonna keep healing myself. I was gonna be like, eventually they'll run out of uh, stamina, but uh, they've got a lot. I mean, luckily it's just the one. Okay, I guess I'll this. Yeah. Give me all that XP. Level 39 for Zapnik. Level 33 for Arolikikus. I don't know how to pronounce that one. Bonnie, did the machines act to attract the dragons? Negative. Dragons are engineered to seek tyrants. Nothing else. Oh, achievement! I hate my job. Survive the double dragon attack in the cursed tower. Ryan reported that the tyrant, Nivalis, was here earlier. Perhaps that's what triggered the dragons. Negative, sir. Nivalis is a relatively weak tyrant. The dragons wouldn't come this deep underground for such prey. Something entirely different lured them. Is it the egg, by any chance? I'll review this later, but for now, we ought to embrace this victory. Let's go back to the guild outpost. You will deserve a rest. Yeah, thank God. Oh, have I got to walk back by myself? Oh, never mind. Hey. Psst. Oh, hello. Oh, it's you! Oh, hey there, Ryan. Long time no see, eh? No, I'm not dead. This is a psychic illusion. Anyway, I'm just making sure that you are fulfilling your destiny. Or whatever. This resurrection machine is a really nasty creation, ain't it? Too bad it doesn't work, though. Not yet. Say, if you got your hands on the blueprints, what would you do? Destroy them. Oh, you're boring. This is boring. Well, do as you please. Blueprints are somewhere in this room. Go find them and do your boring thing, I guess. <sighs> I'm going to pretend I didn't hear any of that. Whatever you do, remember that we must go back to the guild outpost in the frozen tundra to collect our reward. Talk to me if you want to leave now. Well, i got to find the blueprints, so... How would I find them? Apparently they're in this room. I'm guessing big sparkly... Look over here. Uh. Is 
So they said the blueprints are in this room. Nothing's screaming out blueprints to me right now. Um, well, I guess I can always come back from later or something. Yes. Alright, let's heal up. Swap some of these next time on over. go in here. Um, who do I bring out? You, because I can level you up. I'll release you, because I've got your evolved version. I've got the evolved version of you. I'm keeping you, because you're adorable. Um... I can release you. Let's bring Hydra out. And Griff. Um Right team. I might see if I can make more of these. And then I'm gonna look at what was I gonna look at? I was gonna look at something at my brain, just will not remember right now. Um one thing, 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 thing. Oh, the uh, side quest for the Grabbing the specific next summon. That's what I was going to do. So I'll grab the reward off whatever his name is. I'm guessing it's going to be in here. Do, do, do. Here he is. Ryan, your efforts have ensured the safety of this town. Perhaps the safety of the entire world should that machine have actually worked. You have proven to be among the best members of the Tamers Guild. On my authority as a Grand Master, I hereby promote you to a Gold Tamer. Oh yeah! Gotta do the little pose. Yeah! You do realise that this spinning thing isn't normal, right? Yeah, but you know. Gold Tamer! Yes, achieve your gold badge to bring peace to the frozen tundra. Oh, one more thing. A strange woman was looking for you earlier. She must be downstairs. Careful though, she clearly has some temper issues. Oh, is that... Here's your reward for saving the town, of course. Give me those thousand coins and the... Yeah. Excuse me, I have a guild to run during Amelie's mysterious absence. Don't worry though, Amelie is a formidable tamer, so she must be fine. Oh yeah, that's great to hear. Oh, I really wish we could tell him. Hey, why don't you guys tell Edward about Amelie's shenanigans? What if he's loyal to her? I don't want that guy chasing after us. Let's go downstairs and talk with Merida. How do you know it's Merida? Hey, I guess this. <gasps> You're gonna give me the power of ice. Hey, you don't look like a ghost anymore. We can materialize for a little while. It's easy to fool mortals. Anyway, I'm here to give you the remainder of my power, as promised. Oh, we don't need to visit you too. My tomb is far away in Palmyra. You don't have the time. Hmm. Three elements absorbed and the egg still won't hatch. 
Are you guys helping us? You and all your siblings. You should already know. Tyrants who are a contestant of my father's throne are worthless successes. They are feeble and pathetic. For this egg, you will become the ultimate tyrant. A true heir to Omnicron's li lineage lies inside. How do you know that? It's just a dumb egg. Hmm. You will answer that yourselves in due time. Focus on hatching that egg grind. Feed it even more elemental power, and you'll be invincible. Will we really be Vados with this? Vados is a flawed human creation. Technically, not even a true Nexomon. Thus, he can never succeed, Omnicron. A mere aberration. What lies in that egg is a supreme Nexomon. You would never lose. We will meet again, Ryan. Until then, goodbye. Oh, I just remembered. The Dean said that Lydia found Emily's location. She wants to meet with us at the orphanage. Let's go. Yeah, but I've also got to tame the egg. Oh. Okay, that's pretty cool. Oh, another achievement. Element of water. A challenge badge. What does a challenge badge do? Tamers across the world will want to rematch you even sooner. Oh, okay. Um. Right. Um. Before we carry on with the main mission, I'm going to look at getting these Nexomon. So it wants a Glonturn and an Emburion, which I need to go to Ignitia for. So we'll do that. I should probably put my water type out of them. Oh, it's a high chip. You can be the main. <laughs> what did you want? Oh, I need elixirs. Okay. Well, if I find them, I'll keep them for you. Phantom Shards. Oh, another side quest. I'll take a fire whistle. Thank you. <gasps> Thank you. I'll take that. Hello. There are lots of fire type next one nearby. It's a volcano. My point is, the temperatures in this region are soaring because of them. It's a volcano! Tell you what, if you can reduce the population of fire type next month, I'll give you a nice reward. And by reduce, I mean capture. Can't believe I have to clarify that. Talk to me when you're in like, don't know, eight fire type next month? That's how I'll know you've done your work. I think I already do. Hello Ryan, have you been capturing fire type next month? Let's see, you in Ah, Seth! Oh, come on! <laughs> Just the one. Fine. Alright, fine, I'll, I'll go. I'll go fetch another one, I guess. Can I, uh... Oh, it's locked. Can I go in this house? Yeah! Hello, don't mind me. Ooh, you have something there I can take. An ether. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll take it. Okay. Uh, need myself a fire type. Oh, what do you want? Now that Tyrant Mulsimer has been defeated, supplies are finally starting to follow back here. The high quality potions are still red. Do you have any I can buy from you? I don't have any ultra stuff, I'm sorry, but I will keep hold of them for that EXP booster. Right, let's find us a little battle area, shall we? You're a mineral type, but... I can deal with you so I can evolve the next one. Uh, do you want a flan? Oh. Does it want a flan?
Alright, be nice. Yeah. This armor can resist more attacks while minimizing damage taken. Well, that's a very boring description. That reminds me a lot of Aeron. Like, you have Aeron, and then Laeron, and then Agron, I believe. I, my main Pokemon game was uh, Ruby and Sapphire. Oh, damn. I'm after fire types anyway, so. Griffith's level 10. Uh, I've already got you, so. Uh, give me fire types, please. There we go. I'm just going to try and capture you with a fire. Thanks. Please work first time. I'm not... Uh, I don't know. Like, I'm not weak enough to... Uh... Do you want this? Like, maybe that'll help a bit. There we go. Most people are aware of its anger management issues. It can be witnessed exploding just to rest the immense amount of heat in its body. Not rest, reset. I can't read. Send that to storage. I stumble across something that looks memorable. Ah, yeah. oh, for God's sake. I'm thinking that would be weaker, so it wouldn't do as much damage. But I guess it did quite a bit of damage. Let's try going left. I can't remember which one it is, but I know there's one where there's like they have a secret hideout. I'm gonna capture you because um never mind. I'm gonna murder you. Um, because I know I've got a much weaker version of that. 
I could do with a much more powerful version. Casually have a donut in a volcano. Oh, hello! Found you here as well. Maybe I've not been here before. I generally do not know. Alright, let's try this again. That! I just realised. I burnt it. <laughs> I was like, oh, that's good. And then, yeah. Dead. Ooh, Griff is evolving. Oh, yeah. It's a Griff car. Alright, let's try to the right this time. Just probably use a couple of ethers. Oh, I would like to tame you, please. Do you want a green cake? It's fine. Go on, in you get. It's easier to spot this next one during hot days when they are more active. After gathering heat, it shines with a bright red glow at night. Uh, cool. You can go to storage. Right, let's check the right. I may have been here before. I just have no recollection. I was going to take you out for the sake of it. I'm sorry, little buddy. I generally don't remember coming back here. That's because I haven't been here. Aha. Uh -huh. Ta-da! What have we got? 150 coins! A max ether! Keep in that. A tribute of mind. A Vodo companion. 200 coins. Two electric Nexo traps. And 200 coins! I'll take some of them. That's pretty good. I had one where it was essentially just a ton of coins and the tribute mask. I was like, oh. <laughs> Sorry, Poil, I'm running away from you, as adorable as you are. I'm going to look at grabbing this because I've got one that's much not too far. I probably just killed it. Yep. Ah, <laughs> damn it. Never mind. Right. Let's see if I can get some more fire types going. Just kill you in one, sure. <laughs> I don't mean to kill them in one, but I guess I am. Oh, poison bubbles. Ah, oh, but it doesn't do damage. But, it's better than that, so. 
Um, Alright, you'd want a duel. I might draw that guy down there. Just to get a bit more XP going. Fight me! You're right, aren't you? Why yes, I've heard of your hero battles against Molesmer. Well done, kid. Do you mind me testing my skill against someone of your calibre? I mean, I can't really say anything for sure. Uh, okay, good start. I do like with those battles where it's like, can I do this with you? And it's like, well, I didn't say yes. Uh, I'll bring my own fire attack. I know I have high drip there, but high drip is so much weaker. I'd rather take, like, not effective shots. Really? All but one? Oh, I'm now frail. Oh, not demotivated. Oh no. Oh, and it works. Damn it. There we go. I don't have enough stamina to attack. I don't really want to use an Ultra Elixir. Okay, I might have to make the risk. I don't know how well Ghost does against fire. I don't think it's very well. No, it's not. I'm going to risk it though. Maximum's level 48, Nostadal's level 40, Hydra's level 28, Griffgar's gone all the way up to 19. Uh, I'm not going to have that one. Right, what's up this way? Oh, I'm just leaving back around. I've already got you, so. I don't know if I'm meant to do anything with them. I want more fire types. Where are all the fire types gone? I mean, I'll take you. I'm just going to try capturing you and just hope for the best. Its body shape allows it to spin like a giant drill. What's with these one line dialogues? <laughs> I feel like with some of these, ah, this is what's going to be. Hello, little rust. <laughs> Goodbye, little rust. Right, well, I can do that side quest of the eight fire types because now I technically have nine, I think. Oh, hello. Oh, 
Yeah, sure. Hello. Oh, you just tell me how to use a pickaxe. Cool. Oh, I can go up. Oh, is this where I? St I think this is where I started by the. Oh no, it isn't. Never mind. I tell a lie. So it's gonna, I remember there's a bit where you like crash land down here, like from an elevator. Right, so you, you can... Thank you! Right, let's try going left, probably? I'll go try going down. Right, how many shards do I have? I have enough to make four more of the uh, things. I might go do that first. So, we're going back to Param for now. I believe the lab is this way. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to make some of those uh, synergy cores, I think they're called. So I think you need like, what, five of each? Yeah. There we go. Team, someone's not holding anything right now. Cute. I was wondering why you weren't leveling up. I could probably swap them over considering... There we go. And then Rexima can have one. Uh, maybe a defense core? I tell you, what, that's a destruction core as well. But eventually, I'm going to put like the uh, all of them are going to have synergy cores. Right, back to wherever it is, Ignitia. I might go to like, was it was it South Ignitia, or something? I might go there. Are disconnected, so that's why I kept walking right. Uh, okay, as I was saying, we'll go to South Ignition. Oh, uh, there's a glowy thing there, I just missed it. Oh, it was just coins. Um, oh, hello. That actually worked. Right, you're a ghost. What would a ghost eat? I don't know, a 
Peach. Ah. Come on, you come with me. Oh yeah. It's said to be behind all the paranormal activity in most haunted places. Okay. You can go to storage as well. Oh, achievement. Oh, 90 unique Nexomon. Nice. I am making progress. Do you want a jewel? Let's duel! I'm so pathetic. I hate myself. I came here to fight Jin, but I was so scared that I ran off and hit hit. I want to be stronger. I need to be stronger. I want to hunt tyrants, just like real guild tamers. You're the one of them, aren't you? Would you mind teaching me how to fight? I'm just going to make you feel worse about yourself. So... Yeah. I should have used a more powerful move. It's fine. Ah, you missed. Uh, back to the fire type, I guess. Something really annoying about when it has like, it, like between one and three HP left. Level forty-five, level twenty-nine, level twenty-one. Making progress. You seem awfully jolly for someone that just got beat. Uh, are you a fire type? That was the tomb, the fire tomb, wasn't it? Oh, now this is back to the village? Yeah. What would you like? Do I have one of them? No, I just got a stamina core two. Damn. I really want that XP booster. Oh, I'm gonna have to make a stamina core, aren't I? Okay. Uh. Oh, golden extra trap. Thank you. I do like that. There's like more than one uh, type of master ball. Oh. I was going to say, if you're selling them, I will buy them. Get me some super revives. Just gonna top up on these because I feel like there may be some like side mission. Like I know there's that one in the desert which I gotta find the guy. Or buy me some more Nexo traps.
Right, let's head left. Someone that wants to duel. Oh, there's a healing thing. Did I heal? No, I didn't. So I'm gonna grab it. Aha! I could do with you. What's gonna not kill you? That's not. Ah, oh, thank god. Okay. It doesn't pay too much attention to anything that could stress it out and lives a tranquil life absorbed in its own dreams. Oh, how I wish that could be me. Just not have to worry about anything. Right, I gotta try and capture you. So hopefully, your little status thing will help. Come on, be nice. Lumby was cool. Lumby has a very short temper and is known as a skilled fighter. Okay. Um. So what's the things I needed? There are certain fighter types I needed. Karim becomes corrosion. Timber and Lawn, Paulette, Hoglet. So I need to get my blit. Well, I, need, I need to, if I can get a higher level one, I'll get that. Lumbi becomes tiki. Okay. Because I need to get me a pongo somewhere. Um. I'll escape from you, because I don't really need you right now. It's just coming back to haunt me, isn't it? <laughs> I could definitely do with you. What's not going to kill you in one go? That is. Yes, evolve. Become whatever the next thing is. Cerebrius. Now, do you evolve any further? Um. Yes. Okay, you need to go up another level then. Oh, that's Tiki. All right. Get in the Nexo trap. Yeah. It can be found in dark ruins, caves, and abandoned villages. It usually stays away from town since it's a walking fire hazard. Yeah, that makes sense. Right, already got you.
I've already got you. I wonder if um, the one I'm after is probably a bit more overground than underground. I know, because it, it says on the thing that they tend to be found in Ignitia. Right, let's heal up a bit. What did they want? Oh, it looks some potions. Right, yeah. I'll take that, thanks. I mean, yeah, point out the obvious there. I mean, I know it's a water deck someone, which you won't find here. Don't think I've stumbled across you before. <sighs> I really didn't want to kill it in one go. I had an orange, yay! Yeah, I'm going to duel this person down here, because why not? Oh, I think I already have. Oh, I have. Okay. Never mind, we'll just do it again. Oh, frail now. Stop kicking my ass, please. Uh, I can do that too. Oh, what are you? I don't like the look of you at all. Um, I am going to use, I don't have a bloody, I was going to use an, just a regular elixir. Oh, I'm burning now, cool. There we go. Alright, just survived. Just. Level 33, level 31, level 23. I'm not going to have that one. Oh yeah, you're evolving again. An Octolex. Interesting. Uh, right. I can take some of these out of my team actually now. Right, let's head back because I just want to heal. And then I'm going to swap some of those next time on out just so I can evolve some more. Oh, they've had to start a new one. Okay. Um, let's see. I'm trying to think what I probably don't need anymore. 
Have I got two cloddies? No, I don't. Don't need that anymore. Uh... I'm just trying to think what I have that's like the evolved version of whatever else I've got. It'd be nice. Oh, you cancelled them. I don't need you because I've got the other version. I'm guessing that evolves into that. <sighs> Which one do I want? Right, oh, well, you can go in here. And you can go in here. And I'll bring out. a high level that I can evolve straight away. You and you Okay. Um so three elements out of six. minutes or so just so we want to get to the two hour mark so I'll see if I can find some more of those like fire next time on if not I might go to whatever it's called um, Amaya is it I think but I might go there What is it that he wanted? Ah! I do have those. Give me that EXP booster. Thank you. Um, I tell you what, I'll go there now actually. And then I'll know which one I'm after. It was... Uh, I'll, look at, I'll look at the mission in a minute. So... It's... This one, uh, Namansi might show up somewhere in Palmyra, so we'll go there. And I'll see if I can find it. What a lovely place this is! Didn't really explore too much of this place before. So, it'll be nice to actually spend some time here. Oh yeah, I guess because I'm gold I get the extra stuff now. I'm just going to hold on to some of these. I feel like they may come in handy at some point. Um I 
buy some of them. Let's go left. Don't need you. Don't need you. I don't know if like all sorts show up here then. I might look at fighting some of these. Right, I've already fought you then. I've already fought you. I could definitely do with you. Never mind, just murder you straight away. <laughs> I forget how powerful the viewer No, I'm very young. It's a... Uh, Lumeray? I'm going to try capturing you. Don't you have a wind one? Oh, fine. Oh, you're going to be an annoying one, aren't you? Let's try again. Okay, I see how it is. Thank you. Its kicking power is so great that it uses it to bounce on surroundings to confuse its opponent before landing a final disabling blow. Okie dokie. How do I not do so much damage to you? Like that. Come on, get in the trap. Let's try. It appears in very foggy locations, the wisps are its hands granting the power to materialize objects or control illusions. Nice! It's got a lot of health and a lot of stamina as well, which is very good. You could do with some healing. That works. Uh, you're a ghost. Have a banana. Oh, I got one! I jokingly got one, right. Nice. I've not been so crap with uh, what food it likes. The first time I get it properly. Oh, okay, now you're gonna be funny. There we go. Faster and stronger than Moo, its red eye is perfect for seeing in the dark. It leaves a crimson trail when using its spectral powers. Is it just me or is the eye not red? It's blue, isn't it? Unless there's another eye somewhere I've not seen. Hello, do you want to fight? No? Okay. There's 
hope this next one's a bit weaker. Never mind, it went the other way. Another 24 for Griffgar. been here. Well, I'm joining you for the first time. Well, that's not very nice, is it? Shardberg. Ah, oh, just the right amount. Oh, look at you! Ah, oh, whoops. Joe, you know I think one of the first ones I've seen would have been the, the bunny for this one as well. Okay, now that's annoying. Like, you see how it's just gave it just one HP. I think this is stage three evolution. It's a doom reel. Um. Okay, so I'm missing whatever the first one is. So in that case, we can take all those off here. And you can have them. I'm sure Mound evolves. Um. trying to think. It's never a good thing, me trying to think. Oh, I, I need to see if, if Mound evolves. Why not on normal time? Yeah, there you go. That was odd. Oh, I was on normal types, I just went past it. What type is mount? Oh, it's an air type, that's why I can't find it. Doesn't evolve, so I've got it things for no reason. Great, okay. Um... Right, remove all your cores then. Right. Uh... Right, don't think I've been this way before. Oh no, I have. I remember her. 
I don't think I've dueled this person up here. I have. Okay. I am being very forgetful lately. Nothing in here worth taking? Nothing worth taking? See what they're selling here. Well, I'm sure it's more of the same stuff, which is fine. Right, I spent like five more minutes trying to find um, whichever one it is I need because I've already forgot because I'm clever. Uh, who do I swap you for? You, I guess. Oh, I don't need that. There we go. Um, you can sit in here. I was trying to think who I can take out that I can evolve quickly. You're level 37. Oh, I've got two play worms for some reason. I don't need that. Let's try this one. Um. Oh, Flizzard doesn't evolve. Okay. So in that case, I'll swap him out for Cold Four, I guess. Maybe. Oh, I don't know. I, I want like a high level one that I can just evolve straight away. Oh, that that evolves, so I'll, I'll take that one out. So if that's the case. Which one were we looking for? A Namansi. A Namansi. I don't know how you pronounce it. Actually, before I... I've already been this way. Can I go in there? I'm sure. What's secret sauce do? I think that's the uh, one of those like permanent items. There, yeah. Any meal, any meal you feed a wild next one will be three percent more effective. This can be stacked. Okay, so it's actually quite useful.
Um, try going down. Oh, this is where we came from. I don't get in chat with that sand castle for a second. Can I change the water down here? No. There's no real... I don't get why that's a thing there. Right, let's just keep exploring the grass for a bit. And then uh, we'll see what we can do. So I guess we'll go this way. Well, I've already got you, so I don't need you. Ah, Volpressa, I will have you, thank you. Right, I'm going to try and feed you some food. Don't know what the good food will be. Here you go, you can have this. That's fine. You take some damage, and then I can try and grab you. Do I have an electric one? I do. Go on, you go with me, good sir. I got myself a vault presser. This next amount is electrical power emitter, and it's not just incredibly smart, but can also manipulate electricity at will with any part of its body. I quite like the, like the look of Bolt Presser. Right, let's just keep looking through this grass. Blue Pish, I've already got you evolved, so no thank you. Oh, a Monka Pal. I think I've just killed it. Ah, that's fine. Oh, Griff Gar's level 26. Tackle. Uh, sure, you can. You can have a bite. Right, I know I'm like looping back over myself, so I'm just going to try and see if I can. Uh, Find the big patch of grass. Here we go. Lurkos. That was a good one. Uh, let's feed you a donut. just two damage. Nope. Yes! What have we got? Acquire crawling next amount that can turn transparent in order to mimic its environment. Nobody knows why it prefers to crawl, perhaps it enjoys simply playing with its prey. Because that's not scary. It's not scary at all, is it? Okay, this is the one I want. Okay. Oh, this is called Duh. I don't know why it's called Duh, but I guess we'll find out. In a minute, we'll find out. Okay, because you're a ghost. Have some cake. Fine. Don't have cake. There we go. Uh, a spectral nexomon from the Far East. Information about it is spar sparse at best. Okay. 
cool. Well, I've got it now, so. Uh, I'm just going to kill you for the sake of the uh, XP. Level 33. What are you? Whatever you are, I'm taking you. Yes! Found some good food. Come on, you gotta go in this year. It's 85%. Powerful and sometimes malicious psychic Nexamon that people often confuse with ghost type. The ring on its forehead creates very powerful illusions. Okie dokie. Oh look at you, little snush. Right. First capture, best work. Come on snush, you're coming with me. Yes. Because of its slow nature, it relies on paralyzing opponents for sleeping spores to defend itself. Okay. Nice. Ow. Thank you. Oh, yes. Come on, you come with me. Cells are combining attacks of twin mains made of fire emanating from its shoulders, providing natural defense. So, very much like a Ponyta. That's what I'm getting from this one. Ooh, I'm grabbing you. You can come with me. Yes, first try. Right, because I'm getting all sorts around here, I'm going to explore here for like another five minutes until I get the one I'm after. Oh, I feel like you're going to me. Oh, I'm stunned. No! I need to rock wall if you want. I hope that it just keeps trying to defend itself. Mineral next to mine with total control of magnetic fields. The crystal shards around it are like autonomous, independent limbs used for in for defense. I like how I got through autonomous, independent limbs and then just struggled at defense. Right, 
already got you. Yeah, let's, I'll do this for like another five minutes or so. If the one I'm after doesn't show up, then I think I'll wrap it up there. Like, I'll go back to the healing center, heal myself. Oh, hello, you got a quest. And who am I, QB? No, no, let me guess. You want to craft Nexa traps, okay? It's all of Nexa traps. Uh, elemental, I guess? If I had to focus on fancy ones like Psychic and Ghost, among others. There's another fellow who works with the other elements. He lives in the Drake Cars, though. That busy, though. If you really want me to crush how about you help me first? It's a very important task. Perfect someone for your club. Alright, what do you need us to do? My lunch. Go pick it up. <laughs> Head over to the Palmer's restaurant and get my lunch. Okay. Can't craft next to chat on empty stomach after all. Alright, I'll uh I'll do that. Found a revive, which is always good. Back to the restaurant, I guess. <gasps> Ooh, a dreadful. Do you want a flan? No? That's fine. An advanced spectral manifestation, manifestation, no one has ever withstood the glare of the red eyes on its hands. A cold wind blows before it appears on a very dark night. You're very creepy, aren't you? Very, very creepy. Was it this way for the village? Yes, it was. Sure, I'll pay for a lunch. I've already got the super evolved version of you now. Don't need to worry about you. Oh, she was at the bottom, wasn't she? Wow, I walked around the whole thing trying to grab it. Right, so she's left and then down. This elegant and swift next amount is made from the toughest natural metals despite its weight it manages to move without making any noise. That's very interesting. Right, let's give her a lunch. Here you go, here's your lunch. Wait, let's pay for it. Your food is expensive. So my next trust. For good reason though. You'd be capturing next one left, right, left and right for sure. Yay! Okay, 
Um, yeah, I'll spend like an, I'll, I'll spend another few minutes hunting Nexomon, and then I'll I'll wrap it up there. I think. I have a weaker version of you, I think. It's fine. I'll probably find the evolved version. Right, I'm starting to find the same stuff now. Okay, you suddenly shrunk the last time I remember. You're exactly the same. <laughs> so I don't know if there are, like certain ones that like show up in any specific part. Ooh, graceful. I'm gonna try it. Oh, it tells me there! Bloody hell! Probably should have checked out the whole time. That there's a thing on the left that actually tells you if they do like it or not. Would have definitely helped me out earlier. At least you don't have to try and memorize what they like and don't like. Oh, you're being a bit of a nuisance. Go on, in you get. Thank you. It's known to use beautiful flowers and elegance as tactic during battle. Reminds me a lot of Resilia. That's all I'm going to say. Um. Right, so what's the one I'm after? Namancy. Have I stumbled across a Namancy before? That's the only thing I'm questioning right now. Oh my god, why is there not a quick scroll down version? I swear to God, after all this, he's like, oh, you've not seen one. I'm like, oh. Getting closer. Oh. Okay. So it's ultra rare. Okay, that's, that's useful. Well, at least I know when I find it, if I do. I, probably, I think I probably need more of those things. Whatever they're called to be able to get it to show up. Traps. There's actually quite a lot here. Oh, I mean, to be fair, I visited here once, like ages ago, which is probably why I'm finding a bunch of new stuff. If flexible and sneaky next time on the wrist sides in the coldest places, it detects movement and temperature using its tail and ear like fins. Cool. Oh, hello. You're the other version. I'll tell you that. This next time packs a powerful kick and can blow any opponent away. Right, I think I'll probably wrap it up here to be honest. Uh, I'm gonna go back and heal first and then I'll uh, do my little outro stuff. Okay, 
I'm just gonna kill you for the sake of the XP. Rifgar's level 27 now. Right, so let's heal up. Right, so this is where I'm going to wrap it up. Um, a huge thank you to Green Bay Gremlin for the raid. And thank you for those that did stay around for a while to watch this. Um, yeah, uh, quite a bit of progress made on there. We went into the lab of Omnicron, or the lair of Omnicron. Took care of some bad guys. Destroyed the machinery. Um, and then we were doing some side quests, but they've not gone so well. So I think in the next one, I'll just go back to the story. I might try and see if I can find the other elements, unless they're all story based anyway. Um, yeah, um, I will be putting this on YouTube as well. Uh, I have put my previous episodes up there, so if you do want to catch up on anything I've done, uh, YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, and Xbox, they're all Arbillington94, all capital letters. Um, Twitch, obviously, as you can see on here, is Arbillington. Uh, I'll be back at 1 a.m. UK time. Not sure what that translates to us wise there's different time zones i think there's like seven slash eight whatever it is like eastern i think i don't know um yeah so i'll be back around that time uh same thing just like two hours or so doing this i've been streaming this pretty much like every minute of the game that i've played so you won't miss anything and basically i'll, I'll do it until i finish the story but again uh thank you all for watching and i'll hopefully see you in the next one right